Hello everybody, Jet here, and a welcome back to our Dowie Czar playthrough here in uh, Total War Warhammer Through with the fantastic Old World mob, linked down below in the descriptions. Be aware, I am on a slightly dodgy build at the moment because there's been patches, I've still got old builds and things, but because of the hotfix, things may break, so just... Please be aware of that, guys. I'm hoping it'll last for a while, but there is every chance this playthrough may just die. So, yeah. Be aware of that, guys. At some point, I will also have to update, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. But my plan is to try and conquer as much of the Badlands, if not all of the Badlands, before before something like that happens. And uh, a Drak killer here with this exceptional army is heading to Barak Var. Um, see, do I want to abandon this region yet? I could do some public order buildings here, actually. But for now, more armaments. Mm, yeah, let's let's start working on firing drills. Make this army spectacular. Let's keep it. Let's push the high place, and then we're gonna start working our way up here. But this army's not gonna last long. But once it does, you know, we're just gonna do as much damage as we can while this army rushes home. I don't want to send a convoy while I've got so few armaments and <clears throat> spreading them out a bit so they're not all going at the exact same time is probably quite useful because we, we generally, I'd say all the convoy routes on this guys kind of all seem to tend to hit at the same time so it's not the best. Are they coming at me? Come on. Oh yeah. I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna risk a fight. May crash, so we will see. It's early enough that if it does crash, you won't see this. So if you're reading this, if you're hearing this, I probably don't crash on this battle. Probably. Maybe. Three bags full. We're a bit more damaged than I thought. I should not have moved yet. Ooh, I may have done a silly, guys. I may have done a very silly, actually. I'm trying to work out the best place we'd go. To be fair, I might just push up an angle along here. So, let's square myself. Hold shift to do this, guys. actually work quite well. So we're going to be set up to fire for all the gaps. Oh, 
we may end up angling this side slightly. Uh, they can technically get around here, but I'm not that worried. The guns of Zar! Resisting the urge of pushing forwards too much because actually we best to save things like my deathquake until <laughs> Until the enemy are massed <clears throat> I don't want I was about to pull back, but I'm gonna be honest. I don't want to Because I don't want to be over the edge too much Drop Right there. So we can get two off this way, hopefully. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Good hits, good hits. Come on. Yeah, that's a bit rubbish to be there. Oh, crap. Guys, no killing our own units. I love it when people tell you that your own units don't get hit these days. Should have spread them more. Not the best way to hit, but should do good damage. I may have messed this up. Drasburg, get on that goddamn dragon, please. Come on, no! Yes! Turn and kill these guys as quick as we can, please, boys. Oh, 
this is painful. They are seriously getting around my flanks. I should have altered this. You can still turn and assist, please. Back of it, please. Nice. I think my gaps were too small, so I think I've probably done most of the damage to my own faction. I was wondering which to save for. We're going to use this one. Nice. We got this. But I don't think I deserve it, but we did get it. Ooh. That was brutal, guys. I may have lost one unit. I do not think I deserve that. I trust Bravo. I mean, we know who won. I mean, my, these guys did a lot of damage, but Drasbara won the battle. And that's not, not surprising. He is our star unit. He is. I mean, the Dawizar magic is just brutal. The also, also the um, Hell Cannons. Probably. Sorry. Doom Mortar, whatever they're called. Probably misused a bit. I shouldn't have pushed. I pushed too quickly. I was a fool. Oh, let's take them. These guys are so ridiculously junk now. It is scary. Start big firing drills because that does actually benefit the Agobas. It's just insane, considering they're a tier one unit, guys. It's that one I really want to start pushing towards. What are Tabarakva! I mean, seriously tempting, but no. We are going to capture it. Mostly to turn into a battery to be able to, uh, uh, a mortar battery to be able to assist anybody in that area. Oh, 
Burn it to the ground! They're not gonna be able to do anything else. I guess I could have done raiding with them, but... Dry strong! Hmm. I mean, that makes it incredibly powerful, but I don't really need it here. Being a bit risky there by not getting defenses, but I want I need the income at the moment to be fair. There we go. I'm not doing anything else just yet. Maybe. Nope. I want to be able to level here up to be fair. You can be dispatched. Not dispatching. I can't afford to dispatch anybody else just now. Whoops, forgot about that. Oh, you back out. Honestly, I'm, I'm just gonna take it. I'm gonna I'm gonna soak that loss and just rebuild because uh for fighting the battle because there's a single unit. It would have been a pathetic battle to fight, guys, let's be honest, so... It would have quite literally just been a pointless battle. We'd have got... I mean... I'd have probably taken more losses by fighting it. I wouldn't have lost, necessarily lost the unit, but... Can I recruit the other ones relatively quickly yet? I absolutely can. Ooh, I like the look of that. Wow. They're expensive. That's right. Flee, you fools. Doomleth. Up crew. Such a thing is impossible. Ital Andrengi. For now, I'm just going to get a normal one in just to fill it up, but we will slowly, I will probably replace a lot of them. It does feel bad getting rid of units that high level, but at the same time, I mean, look at the stats on these boys. 74 melee defense, 73 weapon strength, all the fire, magic, sundering, you know. Even the base level will have higher melee attack, so yeah. I think it's worth saving for a few turns. Make sure this place is accepting labor. Why in the crap is that? 
Hang on, that should be a factory with the um, iron mine there. So stop it accepting labor. That'll do. Nah, that'll do. Nope. Not sending another convoy out just yet. So just so you guys are aware, this is actually recorded a couple of weeks ago now. Um, I am away the week this will be being dropped, or the weekend around it. So there may be less videos this week, which is why this is being recorded so early. So just a little bit of admin while we are blitzing through this end turn, just so you are aware of what is going on and why that week may be a little bit different than normal. I want to take here, but no, we're going to have to go over here first. I think... Yes, factory, definitely. Oh no, that's materials. Ooh, no. So this region is definitely not a factory. This region has work will have workers, so there we go. I think not. I refuse. He just called me a- that's just mean. Let's have a look what we can do now. Who would accept peace? Can I assist you? Speak your words If I could vassalize them. Corpse master. We are in a very solid position. I, I, what's funny is I've not actually managed to build up half of this territory I've taken, guys. So a big chunk of this territory hasn't actually been taken and held properly yet. So, sorry, it hasn't been taken and converted properly yet. So once it's all up and running, our economy will go through the roof. If I ever get to that point. Extra melee defense for everybody. Endring Kulis Krum. Drazo. Take them. Really? Okay, I guess we are sieging. Kalejinaras Gronet Kazad. Let's bring some goblin support. Yes. Caspin Tamitlon. <laughs> I was really confused for a second then why it wasn't letting me do anything. get this place up and running ASAP. What's this region called? Kualuma. Crooked Legion Mountains. Rams.
Don't need to take all of them, to be fair. Arnaud. Especially if they can't afford it. That's fine, we will be able to. Down to the sounds, it's actually some places like that I really want to um, actually look at tweaking. Uh, extra control, please. Uh, because I need, I want to really put my push my armaments out, armaments out. So we're probably going to do a bit of bouncing around with uh, laborers to sort that out. But I need a bit more money before I can do it. I kind of oh, wish you could just have a floating pool. Wait, they have more settlements somewhere. Okay, that's useful to know. Biggest Hattus is on the roll here. His goblin forces have been uh, very useful in this campaign. Brazo Barikazan! Padrin Lakas! Dumfaumansi! Weird. Ah, there we go. Right. I want to get here sorted. So this is Westgate. We want to chuck a load of people into Westgate to get it leveled up. So let's see, three, four, five, so probably want to chuck a big load in here, so. Wrong button. Ooh, what? Just keep messing around with Westgate. Try three, uh, two hundred to start with. Because we do get the reductions on cost. Yes. Let's so, so look else around here. So we don't have any other. So we've got one here too. Uh, so this is Modra's wall. Well, we want to throw a load out as well. Trying to take it relatively equally from everywhere so I don't burn them too much. Oh, I don't have the actual resources. Derp, derp. But we will next turn. He says while he's burning yes, it all me. off massively. <laughs> but that's fine. This is what my labor is for. You know, it's always a bit of a balancing act, but we're balancing it nicely at the moment. Um, I'd like to have infinite of both, but we'll get there. At the moment, I really want to push out my armaments, so. 
And we've got a couple of convoys out there getting more labor, who will be bringing back more involuntary laborers. The laborers with jobs, no pay. So this one's going to be a mixed one. I'm actually going to convert this to a factory. But we'll keep it mixed. It's good to have the odd mixed one. I tell you what, the High Elves may be our next biggest threat and they are a little bit of a pain for us to fight. Ooh, and their goddamn floating fortress! I bring Azurian's fire. Good, good. I am in need of more husks for my hordes. <laughs> They're on the ropes. That is all good. Oh, we expect it's a bit hard to tell our border there because of them, but it's weird. I don't keep getting the option to move. It's not telling me to move him any time. Oh. Durung and Dreg. Why are you running? Don't you want to play? Anyway, guys, we are going to end this one here. Thank you very much for watching. I do hope you are enjoying this playthrough. Please do like and subscribe if you are. And as always, an extra special thank you uh, to my channel members and patrons. That is Monsterbound, Philip F, Nose Nose, Andrew T, Prataru, Brandon, Space Ace 475, Coding Monster, Jason F, Egg, Scrin, Jared Horn and Good Sir Twisted. Thank you all.